Planning your day is hard, but I believe it's easy if you have the right tools. In this video, we will take a look at the five best apps to plan your day. So without wasting our time, let's get started. The first app I have is Trello. The freemium task taking and allocation app can help you plan your day and even weeks and months. With easy to use interface, you can browse and add tasks. It comes with to do, doing and done cards. You can add more if you want. Adding something here gives you access to some tools such as checklists, activity, members, attachments, etc. You can add members in the option but you will only find the members with access to this board. To add members to a board, go back and add members in the top right menu. And then you will find the members to add to a task. Anyway, the app reminds you of tasks as you go and you can check each once it's finished. There is a premium version but the free version is all you need if you want to work with your friends or alone to get things done. If you don't want something as advanced as Trello, then a simple note taking app will do the job. Many devices come with a note taking app. iPhone has Apple Notes, Samsung devices come with Samsung Notes and other Android phones come with Google Keep. A note taking app can help you organize tasks and remind you when the time comes. You can add checklists, description, voice and more. All the note taking apps offer free versions for individuals. Check out the link in the description to find the best note taking app. The third on the list is Any.do. The app is not as advanced as Trello and it's not as simple as a note taking app. The app is a task management tool and it is focused on individuals. It comes with a nice interface with an add new button. You find so many pre-made tasks to begin with. Just tap on either and add a description. It can remind you before the due time and you can set the subtasks and check them as you complete each. Apart from all those features, you find a separate option to plan your day where you can see the data for each task. Anyway, you can also share the tasks with your family and friends to include them to collaborate. Moreover, you can sync your calendar to help you organize everything at one place. The app comes with a few options such as location based reminding, support for whatsapp reminders, daily planner etc in the premium version. Moving on, if you truly are serious about saving time, then the app Toggle is for you. The purpose of the app is purely time saving. You can't add any notes or allocate tasks. As you start working on something, you just put the description and then work on the project. If you stop or do something else, change the task. The app will give you the idea of how much time you're actually spending on each thing. Well, it goes to hell if you don't know what to do with that data. Now it's the time to add one of the apps which I mentioned earlier to add tasks. And with the help of Toggle, see what is being done and what's not. The combination of those tools can help you save hours every day. Anyway, Toggle app also offers a reports section where you can find the time spent in total and what percentage is billable if you are working for someone else. The last app to plan your day I have is TikTik. It's now TikTok, so be careful. TikTik is a simple to-do list app which can help you organize and separate your personal and work life. Alongside those two, you find a gym, shopping and a few more. The app does not require an account and it's super easy to use. To add a task, hit that add button. You will find the deadline, priority, label and board. You get more options after creating the task and tapping on it. You can add subtasks, labels and reminders. The reminder also supports location for free. So whenever you go for shopping, the app will remind you to get the forgotten stuff. Alright, those were the 5 best apps to plan your day. Thanks very much for watching this video. I hope it helped. Please let me know what you think of each app in the comments down below and hit that subscribe button to get my upcoming videos. Until then, take care.